Hi everyone, welcome to Tway's Humble Kitchen. Today we'll be making flan, also known as creme caramel. This recipe makes four servings using standard ramekins. If you want to use a round cake pan, double the recipe. Just make sure your pan fits into a bigger one for a water bath. So let's get baking. Before starting your caramel, make sure you have your ramekins or pan ready. Also prepare a pastry brush or a spoon with some water. We start by making a simple caramel with sugar, water, and lemon juice. Amounts are below. In a medium saucepan over medium heat, mix those ingredients together and let cook for 8 to 10 minutes until the sugar dissolves and it becomes a light brown color. Use the pastry brush to brush water along the edges of the pan to keep the caramel from crystallizing. Keep a close eye on the caramel because it will change color very quickly once it starts boiling. When it's light brown, take it off the heat and immediately pour it into the ramekins or pan. Evenly coat the base of your ramekin by moving it around and letting the caramel settle into place. Then set this aside and we'll move on to the creme. You'll need sweetened condensed milk, 2% or whole milk, sugar, 1 egg yolk, 2 whole eggs, salt, and vanilla extract. Amounts are within the description. In a mixing bowl, whisk together the two eggs and one egg yolk until you get an even consistency. In a medium saucepan over medium high heat, stir together the sweetened condensed milk, 2% or whole milk, sugar, salt, and vanilla extract. Bring it to a boil, which should take about eight minutes. While you wait, boil some water in a kettle or separate pan for the water bath. Preheat your oven to 325 degrees. Once the milk mixture starts to boil, take it off the heat. Now comes the tricky part. You'll need to incorporate this hot mixture into the eggs. The key is to whisk vigorously while pouring the milk in slowly. Otherwise, the heat from the milk will cook the eggs. Next, use a strainer to remove any pieces of egg that may have formed. Then pour this mixture into your ramekins or pan over the caramel. Pour the boiling water into the outside pan to about half the height of your ramekins. This water bath will help the flan cook evenly. Then carefully place this into your preheated oven for about 35 to 45 minutes. The key is to cook this slowly. At about 35 minutes, start checking your flan by shaking it. If the flan has waves, it's not ready. But if it jiggles from the center, like this one, then it's done. Remove them from the oven and let cool. Once they cool at room temperature for about an hour, they should be set. If you like, you can eat your flan warm. But to ensure that they have completely set, wrap them in plastic and place into the refrigerator for a few hours. The final step is to flip the flan over onto a plate. Start by running a knife around the edge of the flan. Then turn it over above your serving plate and shake the flan loose. It may take a bit of effort. Once it's out, make sure you get all the delicious caramel onto the plate too. Then move the plate around until the caramel is evenly distributed. Then grab a spoon and enjoy! Caramel left at room temperature will harden. The best way to clean up is to put water into the saucepan and heat it, then stir to loosen the caramel. You can also soak your ramekins in the saucepan. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for upcoming recipes.